and teleport outside of the town because I can't teleport right inside the town unless I was wearing the girly armor. Bosa's Fury. Um, trigger by holding Y. Never going to remember that based on the letter. Link. Oh, hey. Link. Thanks to you, all of the divine beasts have returned to us. And the spirits of the champions are free. We will all be awaiting your clash with Ganon at Hyrule Castle. You know, back when this game first came out and I was reading about the plot, because the plot of this was pretty simple. You go read about the plot for like 10 minutes and it's like, oh, I'm done. Wow, I, I just spoiled the whole game for myself, basically. Right? And um, I'm, I'm reading about how all the other... What am I in here for? Put on my girly clothes. Um, I'm reading about how all the other heroes are dead, right? And then the princess has been trapped in the castle f holding back Ganon for a hundred years. And I'm like, man, I hope she isn't dead too. I'm so glad that she's not. And that it looks like she's going to be... Or is there a chest in here? Whatever. That, that, that it looks like she's going to be a character in the sequel. Which I'm very excited for at this point, obviously. Let's actually go back in here. Put this back on shrines, right? Because why the heck not? Hello, queen child. Oh, is she not? Is she not voiced? No, you're back. Phew. I'm glad you're okay. And truly, I am. I'm pretty sure I'm too old for you, kid. And the Wurz is no longer a threat to the town. I'm still worried about a little large er, threat to the High Rule, but at least my people won't be troubled by Nuboris anymore. Oh, there's stuff. I want to offer you these as thanks for your help. I trust you'll accept them. Now these pieces of equipment are priceless treasures of the Gerudo people. They were once worn by Lady Urbosa. And since you and Lady Urbosa were friends, it's only right that you have them. Yeah, I agree. Give me my treasure. There's two of them this time, though. That's interesting. Which makes sense, I guess. Because the, the Ganons always mirror the fighting style of the champions, right? Can I take this? Yeah, okay. Apparently not. Okay. Be calm yourself, Buliara. You desire the helm? Do I want the helm? Yes? I see, and yet despite the great debt we owe you, I cannot just give such a precious thing to you. Mm. But you are up against the enemy of Lady Urbosa. And if you truly desire it, then perhaps I can lend it to you. So, lend it to me for the duration of fighting the thing in there but I did that already I'll, if, if I need it let me know all right you know I'll come back and try to do that again um, yeah the Ganons always mirror the fighting style of the champion that they defeated and that one used sword and board and also like Herbosa is the only champion who could have used a sword and a shield because she uses like the one-handed sword Whereas the others were a trident, which is two-handed, a bow, which is two-handed, and that big smasher thing, which is two-handed. So I'm betting this is a sword and a shield, right? Scimitar of the Seven. That's got to be the seven her uh, heroines, right? Okay. Did I have room for that? Okay. Didn't think I did. Sure. Daybreaker. Shield was cherished by the Gerudo champion Urbosa. Gold used to make it is, or it was <laughs> picked to ensure a design that is both lightweight and very durable. Inventory is full. All right, cool. Let's drop a shield then. Um, let's drop this pot lid. Why do I have a pot lid? Cool. And, um... Yeah, there is at least one more thing that you guys told me I really need to do in this area. 
um, specifically out of that, that dragon skeleton or whatever that um, I marked a while back. But there's something I want to do first. Before any of that, I want to head back to... I was going to say my house, but um, apparently something else is happening here. You have overcome every challenge laid before you. Ruta. Rudania. Meadow. Naboris. In the order I did them, too. beasts are now free. With the strength you have attained, I am certain you can unlock the powerful force hidden within. Go to the Shrine of Resurrection and return the Sheikah Slate to its terminal. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. Not doing that today. Not starting that today. Uh, let's head to my house. Which is what I was trying to do. Excuse me, princess. And, um... Let's put this stuff away. Rivali's gale is now ready. Thanks for ruining the moment, Rivali. Can I get, like... Let's do this. Oh, God damn it. Fine. Let's, um... Drop any of these. It doesn't even matter. Give me this. And then, um... Pick this up. Put it there. All right? Get a, get a good shot of all of them together. Pick that up so the game stops prompting me to look over there. I mean, Link's been getting some of his memories back this whole time, right? But, like, he doesn't really remember these people. I feel like, though, he would still want to honor them, right? Let's um, go put on some real clothes, too. And probably doesn't really matter. What's my highest defense pants at this point? Barbarian and climbing are basically the same, so let's do that. Right? Just for just for funsies sake. So I'm gonna head back to the desert in a minute, right? But um Might as well run around for a second or so. Wearing just normal stuff. Look at the beams. There's so little left to do, man. Like, I'm just, sorry, I'm just, I'm still reeling a little bit from it. Like, I know there's a couple of shrines out here that I found, but didn't really ever do anything about, right? Like, that's a shrine. There's a couple of shrines that I literally unlocked, but never finished, right? Don't know where they are now, though. Not even sure where I'd look for them. They were, there was... Yeah, there's one there. Wasn't there another one, like, up in this area, too? Somewhere? Or am I misremembering? I don't know. I know there was, like, two of them. Was there one, like, over here? There. That, it was there. Okay. So there's a couple of shrines I've, I've found, but didn't actually do yet. And I could do those, right? The whole map's unlocked. Champion's Ballad is unlocked. <sighs> right? Like, um, and, and, like, you can go fight Ganon whenever you want, but, like, the way the game wants you to do it. I think you guys said it's literally in the dragon, right? So let's delete this. It's, it's in this guy then, right? So let's put it there. Then let's go up here to this and put change it to that. And come back down here to this. Change it to this, right? I don't know, it just I mean <laughs> I get like this towards the end of like Pokemon games and stuff too. You guys have seen this before. It's not that weird. Not that unexpected, right? 
but still. And like, I know there are some people who have played this game like way harder than I have and gotten way more into it and actually know their way around the land, like the back of their hand, kind of like I am with Skyrim, right? And I'm, I'm probably never going to be that familiar with this version of Hyrule. It, I'm probably never, if this is, that's probably, this is probably never going to be that game for me, right? But, um, man, I am going to miss this game. And I'm the kind of guy, right, that I'm not going to come back and play it anymore once I'm done. Simply because, you know, oh, hey, it's one of these guys. You two, go away. Screw off, man. Um, because anything I would I would do in the game, I would want you guys to experience it with me. And once the main Let's Play is over, there's really not going to be any good time for that anymore, right? Die. Freaking... Go away! Need to deal with Yiga, asshole. Good thing his aim's so bad. Cool. And your bananas. And your money. Neat. That was fun. Um, I don't know how many more, like, armor upgrades and stuff I'm going to do either, right? Because, um... Like, so, like... <clears throat> it differs from, from person to person, right? But, like, like some of you guys have said, I should try to upgrade as much as I can because Hyrule Castle is really hard. Others have said, no, if you can handle all of the Ganons, then you can handle Hyrule Castle. I'm, I'm mostly worried about the Guardians outside. I'm, I'm just running around at this point. I really should be trying to get to that location that I literally just marked. But at the same time, I'm... Uh, there's also, like, like landmarks I want to see, too. Like, if there's any landmarks you guys want to see me get to before the end, of course, tell me. Again, the end is a little, is still a ways off, though. Right? It's not like we're at the end of the game yet. I'm just, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. Right? right. Did that kill him? Cool. Is there another one over there? There's a horse over there. I really should be trying to get to that location. But I, I'm just not doing it. It's over here. This is it like a camp? Hey, it's shoes. Did I need shoes for anything? I don't know. Whatever. Is there anything over here? Anything of interest over here? Not really. It's a deer. Chop down some of these trees while I'm here. I don't know. I may, I may just dick around for the rest of this episode, guys. I apologize if I, if I do. Boom. Give me that. I need 50 for the next one, right? For the next thing. What am I at? What does that put me at? I saw it, and then I and then it went away. 26. I'm at 26. Okay, cool. No, no. These are all, all giving me two at a time, so that's good. Can I get both of these? I can get one of them. Fine. Finally blew myself up, so, you know. And 50. Beautiful. So um, I guess we're doing that today. We're going to head back to Terrytown and do Terrytown stuff. Because why the heck not, right? Where is that? Look at all four of them dancing around up there now. Isn't that adorable? All right. Cool. Hi, doggo. Hi, friend. Hey. Brought some wood for you. And not that kind. The, the other kind. 
Yeah, that guy. Yeah, I know I am. Now what do you need? I just wanted to talk to you about something a little personal. What's wrong? Oh, not that kind of personal. Actually, I got engaged. Now wait, that cute Grito chick? Yeah, it's Ronson. You're a cute couple. Thank you. Anyway, we want to have a little ceremony to celebrate, but we need someone priest-like to officiate. Could you look for someone priest-like for us? Priest-like, huh? If we're looking for a people devout enough to have a priest-like person, I'd suggest Zora. Good luck, you'll need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, I know, I got it. It's fine. So I'm assuming that in the future of this particular version of Hyrule, there's just going to be this one weird town out in the middle of nowhere where all of the descendants, their names end in sun. So weird. All right, let's get to Zora's Domain, then. Teleport! Oh, good battle tip. Chucking metal at people hurts. Never would have guessed that. Okay. Teleport again. It's a crab over there. Gonna have to go grab him. Yeah. Now, someone whose name ends in sun. If I know this person already, I don't know that I know them. So let's just look around. Hello. Does your name end in sun? No. You have a quest. Hi. Hi. Uh, what is it? Oh, hey, mister. I'm busy frogging. Frogging. Yep. Since mom hasn't come back from fishing yet, I've been catching hot-footed frogs and selling them to earn some money for our family. She's probably dead, man. Uh, you... We're just pitying me, weren't you? You felt sorry for me, didn't you? Well, I don't need your pity. If you want to help donate some hot-footed frogs, you can find them easily on rainy days. I really need to get uh, some for me. Five frogs should be enough, got it? Sure, kid. There's also apparently somebody I never talked to around here that I should have, too. I remember, I don't remember why, though. I remember one of you guys telling me this a long time ago. There's another quest. Hello. La-dee-doo. Split the feet of a veiled falls sight. Oh, you're the Hylian who helped our prince sight on. You're so handsome, too. Okay. Why am I getting hit on by kids today? Your looks still don't compare to Prince Sidon, that's for sure. But you're not half bad. In fact, I wouldn't mind uh, talking with you for a bit. Okay, kid. Um... I, I'm just gonna go. That you're you're a little weird. Okay, I'm gonna go walk around a little bit. Who are you, Lido? Okay. Has a quest. R Riven, Rivan. What's your quest? Oh, it's you. We met at Zora River. It's me, Lido. Thank you for coming so quickly. Okay, I remember you. You have appeased Ruda. I can express cannot express how grateful I am. However, uh, those of us in Zora's domain are still feeling the ramifications of the chaos that Ruda wrought. Oh. That's why my senior apprentice, Frank, and <laughs> Frank, pulled the leather, Frank, and I uh, are <laughs> repairing the domain. However, our materials are a bit depleted. Oh, materials? Yeah. Yes, repairs require a large number of luminous stones. You'd find plenty of them around Upland Zorana. Have you by chance already stumbled across some luminous stones during your travels? For instance, if you have ten of them, it'd be a big help. Do I have ten of them? Okay. Do I not have them? Yeah. Cool. Here are the stones. Do I have them? Alright, cool. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Oh. oh my, you really brought all ten. Thank you, yes. I will happily take those luminous stones from you. This is really long-winded, holy crap. Oh, that's right, I must reward you. A diamond. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, two diamonds, holy shit, man. Oh. That's nuts, thank you. Uh, <laughs> okay. So I get another diamond for every ten luminous stones I bring him? Holy shit. Okay, because diamonds are, like, important. Not just, like, because they're valuable, but for, like, 
repairing the champion's weapons if I want to use them. Right? Oh, that's very good. I'm very happy about that. I'm going to wander around for a couple more minutes. You have a quest. Yeah. Hello. Mm. Link, the divine beast hasn't been appeased, but I fear there is still something that threatens the domain. Okay. Mm. There's a red mean monster called a Lionel that lives on Poimus. I killed that already. I really need a picture of a Lionel. Give me a picture of any red mean Lionel, not just the one in the mountains. What do you say? Can you get a picture of a Lionel? Um, can I still encounter red mean yeah. Lionels? This late in the game? Okay. There is this fool in the domain who goads people into jumping off of Shatterback Point on Plymouth Rock, or Plymouth Mountain. It's an incredibly dangerous jump, and this guy pressures people into jumping off by questioning their courage. He's a real bottom feeder. If this keeps up, someone is surely going to wind up horribly injured. I need a picture of a Lionel to show everyone how scary they are. Maybe people will stop going up there. Um, yeah, I, I didn't actually ask. I was just going to do it. I'll leave the details to you. Just bring me a picture of a Lionel so I can describe them. Terrible detail, thank you. Do I not have one? I'll be fine. Yeah? Okay, that might be the one you guys were telling me about, because you mentioned I should do it before I go fight the Lionel up there. Hopefully I can still find a red main Lionel. Let me know if I can't. Or if I can, tell me where to do so. Alright, people whose names end in sun. Um, I don't, I don't know what your name is yet. Gianto Link, it seems that I was wrong about you. Seeing Divine Beast Valhuda's Even though we lost Lady Mifa, it seems she can still help you fight against Climate Ganon. Oh, I'm sorry, I did not introduce myself sooner. I am Giato. Your name doesn't end in sun, so I don't care. Uh, historian... Stone monument, okay. Most like, most likely, the ten stone monuments outside the domain are in the same awful condition. I'm thinking about collecting the contents of all the stone monuments and compiling them into a book. But with these old legs and fizz traveling to all, ten stone monuments will take a great deal of time. This is why I think I'd like to ask a favor of you. I'd like you to find all ten stone monuments around Zora's domain and tell me what they say. Okay. Oh, thank you. I'll find a guy. I'll look up a guide for it later or something, right? Yeah, okay, sure. <sighs> okay, I don't care. I, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Stop talking. Somebody use name ends in the sun. Shatter. Cool. Your name didn't end in the sun, did it? Capson! If during your travels you meet any engaged people, I would like to introduce I would like you to introduce them to me. I think I actually talked to this guy once before. Joining two souls is an honor, one I uh, shall stake my life on. Just one more wedding and I shall be fulfilled. Get a load of this, man. You're not going to believe the, this this massive coincidence. I have been waiting to hear those words. Now please tell me the specifics. Whisper, 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 whisper. whisper. As for the location, hmm. Tarrytown in Akala. Akala isn't too far from here. It would please me in a hurry there right away. By yourself? No need to worry about me. I have always had confidence in my fins and feet. It has been a long while since I have had work. I am eager to put my skills to good use. Now you should come as well. I will start my preparations in Tarrytown in the meantime. Cool. I'm, he's still going to make make it there before me, which is absolutely nuts. I love the Terrytown music too. It's just so good. All right, cool. Let's um head back to Terrytown then. Again. Ah, uh, the music comes in. It's just beautiful. Hey, Dogo. All right, where's where's the the groom? Oh, wow. Okay. I'm like, where is he? But like, this is where he used to be, and he's just not there now because it's finished. Oh my god! Okay, cool! This is so pretty! There's a... there's a... Mule? Okay. Didn't know there were mules in this game. 
And then look at this. Look at the goddess. Got a little, got a little bell shrine thing. Hey, there's the love birds. Hey, you found Azora. Thank you, really. He and I talked earlier, and he said that he literally was a priest before he retired. You can't get more priest-like than that. I mean, a, a current priest would be more priest, priest-like than that. And his name is Capson, so I have no objections there. It really is amazing that you were able to find someone priest-like who also had an acceptable name. Well, next is, uh... Of course, we'll have to invite guests in order to hold a ceremony. Guests. I'm talking about my boss, Bolson, and my subordinate, Carson. I see. However, I've got to prepare for the ceremony, so my hands are full. Could you invite them for me? Where are they? You know where they are. The boss and Carson are in Nintendo Village, right? I see. Excellent. I'm counting on you. All right. Where in Nintendo Village? We'll probably do that next time, guys. I'm thinking. Because um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cut a little bit out of this. A little bit out of this episode, which might make it a little short, but that's better than it going like... 20 minutes long or something, right? Um, so we'll, we'll do that next time, but still. Like, man, we, we, put in, we put in so much work here today. Look at this place. It's beautiful. Like, this has got to be the town finished then, right? What's left? Just th their wedding? Do we actually get to see their wedding? That's so cute. I really hope so. Is this a diamond? Yeah. 2,000. Holy shit. Do I have any other jewels that I can... That's the wrong button. Any other jewels that I can sell? Um, where are my jewels? Where's my jewel section? Okay. I've got some. Could sell to this guy. I don't want to sell the diamonds, obviously. In case I do decide to use the champion's weapons, right? I'd like to keep my... my I'd like to keep hold of those for that. Not super concerned with it, though, right? Need to cook some food too. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna stop for today. What what a great what a great few episodes, man.